everyone, so I am ill at the moment, in case you couldn't hear from my voice. Um, so please excuse that. Also please excuse the blank walls behind me, they look exceedingly, exceedingly weird. It's just where I'm doing my room up, I've removed my carpet, uh, I had to change carpet. And, um, <clears throat> taking the posters down, and then I don't know where the bed's going to fit, so I can't really put all my posters back up until I know where the bed's going to fit. But I'm going to start putting a few more posters up, and now you can see what's really on the back of my door behind the Evanescence poster. Um, sorry, this is a remake of a video I did maybe a year or two ago. Um, I don't actually remember when I uploaded this video, to be perfectly honest with you. But it's my band merch collection video. And I know I've got a lot more since I last made the video. Um, so there's this video and the next video are going to be recorded all like one, one straight after the other. It's just so now I can bring my clothes back into my room and put them in my wardrobe. So it's all going to be recorded like now. So I'm going to move back a tiny bit without disturbing the stepladder. And start with the video and um, it should all be in alphabetical order i'm not 100 percent certain if it will be or not so first i'm going to start off with hats um then i'll move on to jumpers then it'll move on to like t-shirts and leggings and stuff so i have this my chemical romance beanie with the um danger days spider on it which is pretty cute oh, hello what i'm dead um, snapback. Then these are my two newest ones. Have this one, this Lincoln Park one, and I have this Lincoln Park one. And they're pretty cute, and they've messed my hair up. But yeah, so I love them. They are really, really cute. Um, yeah, and they came from the Lincoln Park website. The Holland and Dead one came from. Um, the Holland and Dead concert I went to and I don't know where the MCR one came from and um, a lot of this stuff is stuff either I bought myself or someone else has bought for me some of it is genuine merchandise some of it I don't know whether it is or not it might just be something bought from like, online that's not a genuine piece of merchandise so yeah I'll move on to jumpers this is one of my favourites because it's really soft and fluffy but I generally just sort of wear it in, in and around the house it says it may seem like I'm listening to you but in my head, I'm listening to Hailstorm, and it's a really cute little jumper thing, and it's really comfy and cosy and awesome. There it is this. I'm sitting on him, which really doesn't help. Um, this one, which admittedly I haven't worn for a while, it's just a black bob hides hoodie, and um, the pattern goes all the way around, and the little pull zip pull bit is the um, black bob hides logo. Um. And then I have these that hoodies are coming at you all out of alphabetical order. Um, there we go, there's this Evanescence one, which I got from the concert that I went to. That's the front, and that is the back. And with their 2017 tour, which was brilliant. No. Um, this one I got from the 2012 tour, it was 2012, the 9th of November 2012. Um, there's that on the back, this one's a zip one, and I probably should probably have zipped it up before recording the video, because then I could have shown you what the front looks like, but no, I wasn't smart enough. Was not smart enough. And then across the front, it just says Evanescence with the um, zip. And I prefer the zippy ones anyway, they're like, easier to get on and off. This one I don't think is as big of a deal that's not zipped up. This one is my Avril Lavigne one, which I got from her tour in 2011. And um, on the front, on one side, it just says that. But it's a really cute jumper and it's really comfortable and I've had it for six years now, just over. Um, and it's really comfortable, which is always brilliant. And this is the last one, which I also got at the 2017 tour. It's another Evanescence one with that logo on it. And it's just repeated again on the front. Small one on the front. 
<clears throat> and they're lovely and amazing and I love them. So before I start getting onto the clothes, I'm well aware that I probably missed something. I mean, I know they are clothes, but onto the t-shirty bits. I'm well aware that I probably missed something. There's probably some stuff in the wash or somewhere else. Um, I know I have a, another Nirvana one and a Slayer one, but they're not actually in my house. And I just have a feeling I'm probably missing some stuff. So as long as you guys are aware of that, um, we're all cool. So yeah, should be in alphabetical order. Let's get started. <clears throat> so is this one, which is a day to remember. It's just a little, you know, guy being attacked by birds. So that's pretty cute. I'm going to be folding them up after each thing, just so they're neatly in a pile to be put away. Um, <clears throat> asking Alexandria. It's just this one. Which is pretty cute. This asking Alexandria one. I do love this one, but it's quite small. Um, and generally, I go for like extra larges and t-shirts. So I don't actually wear this one as much as I should do, but I love it. Um, oops, I've picked two up together. Um, there's this one. The reckless or relentless one, and this one, which was cut by someone else. But it's really cute. It, you know, it's cool. It says bitches love Ben Bruce, and that's that's a pretty true fact. Um, and I think this may be the last of my Ask Alexandria match. It's just this best top tank top thing with the monster on it, who's pretty awesome. I lied to you. This is also Ask Alexandria. It's the big one. And he's pretty awesome. I lied, sorry about that. Now I think we're at the end of my Ask Alexandria. But I'm not 100% sure. Here we go, this is a Venge 7 hold. And it is pretty cool. I love it. It's a Seize the Day one. Now, this isn't an official piece of <coughs> Abilene merchandise. But it is one she's been seen wearing. She's been seen wearing the white one and she's also been seen wearing the, the black and red striped one and that was in her He Wasn't video. Pretty sure that's a black and red one. But I'm too tired to think it's not so it's not official merch but I encounter it as the merch and it's not Abby Dawn either, which will be in the next video. Um so then there's this Avril Levine one as well. Um and it's got the under my skin crosses on the seas and it's really comfortable and pretty awesome um, and I do love it. There's this one with a picture of her on it and she's cute and awesome and it doesn't look quite as good as it does when you wear it because it's just like kind of crumpled up at the moment from being folded for so long so yeah. And there's this Avalvian one which came from her tour in 2011 and that's the one I went to London UK on the 21st of September so that was awesome um, now we're moving on to the bees so as you can tell I have quite a lot of that match onto the bees so we have Blackfell Brides there's quite a bit of Blackfell Brides merch actually I didn't realize how much I actually own until I was sorting through these Whoops. Um, it's this one. I think this is the one that I wore when I went to see them in concert um, back in 2014. But then it might have actually been the one I'm going to show you after this one. I can't remember. But there's this one. Which is cool. Yeah, I think this was the one I wore to the concert actually. The Black Bob Brides with the little wings, which is really, really cute. As I said, there's a lot of Black Bob Brides. Yeah. Um, oh, that's upside down. There's this one. And then on the front and on the back is that. I didn't go to that tour. This was, I was it bought in a bundle of clothes from someone else. Um, who bought it from there? Um, and that was ages ago. This one, which is really cool because it has that on the back, a little corsety bit on the back, and I think that is awesome. And yeah, 
it's pretty cool it looks awesome so yeah um, then there's this one this is that on the front and that on the back this is a piece of unofficial merchandise but I liked the um, sleeves and it is of the concert that I went to see them in in 2014 which had Attila, Fearless Vampire Killers and Drama Club um, I didn't have a lot of money after the concert mainly because I did like um, VIP tickets to see them so that took out a lot of money and yes so I didn't have a lot of money I did buy a couple of bits in there but I bought that outside because it was cool and there's this one which is the one that came this is UK tour it came with the VIP um, ticket purchase bundle this one with Andy and it's got holes cut in it which is kind of awesome and they're cut in the front and in the back as well I don't know how well you can see those holes so I'm like holding a lot of these things up in front of my face so I can't actually see if I'm showing you guys it so I apologize for that <coughs> and then there's this one black world brides with their faces and that's one of my favorite ones and I'm pretty sure that's the one that my friend bought me back from America and there's this one which I love this one as well it's really comfortable and pretty nice and it's pretty cool looking with like the bones sort of wingy bones thingy and now we move on to bring the horizon um but why it's all done there's this one which is the, i think that was the one that i wore to see them in concert um halloween 2016 and it's pretty cool i think it's awesome this one which is says i can't drown my demons they know how to swim which yes i love it it is pretty cute um, and it's white which is weird because most of my clothes aren't white in which you can probably see by most of these videos most of them are black um, and there's this Spring Horizon one which is one of my favourites because of like it's pretty big and it's just like messy and like it's awesome it is awesome um, then there's this one which I actually bought from the um, concert it's just a tie-dye one with the umbrella and because it was a Halloween it was a spider webby umbrella which I think is actually pretty amazing um, like it was literally Halloween day that I saw them um, and then there's this one which is weird because it's grey but I still like it and it's got fluff all over it whoops this one with the wolves so it's pretty cute Okay, now we move on to Bullet for My Valentine. There's this t-shirt, which is sort of an off-the-shoulder one, and it actually has halter neck straps for it, but it's <coughs> that album logo. It's the album logo for Fever. Um, I was just going to show that to you guys, so that's pretty awesome. And there's this Bullet for My Valentine one for Waking the Demon and it's got this on the back as well and I love it, I've had that for years like I've probably had that for like 7 years or something I don't know, it might not have been that long but I know it's been like at least 6 um, and this one it's just a logo and it's actually been cut down the side um, yeah, and it's awesome it's pretty cool. Now we move on to Evanescence. So we've got this one, which I bought from their 2012 tour. It's the front, and that's on the back. And I went to the bottom one. This is London. That's the one I went to. Mm -hmm. This one, which is a little cute one with Amy Lee on it. And she looks awesome. Wait, if I can actually stretch it out properly. So she's got a fold in her face. She looks awesome. Um, I do like that t-shirt which I also bought from the concert that one which is pretty cool I'm saying they're pretty cool fully well aware that if I didn't own them uh, if I owned them I wouldn't I thought they weren't pretty cool I think they all are I know there's one that I didn't buy at the concert 
and I bought and I went to the concert but there's that one which is sort of like a rainbow sort of purpley bluey greeny um, swirly logo which is sort of similar to the one that's on my jumper and there's this one which I wore to the concert um, the last concert I saw them in which has lyrics my heart are broken on and it actually matched my hair um, when I went um, I'm well aware that this video has got quite long and I'm still not even halfway through my uh, collection so what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop this video now um, and next week's video is going to be the second part to this just makes it slightly easier if I come across any photos of me wearing any of the band merch for either this week's video or next week's video then I shall um, include those photos in the video But yes, for now, thank you guys for watching and I will see you next week.